goodness, there's a peacock. And so another peacock. Butterfly. There's one there. Up there. And I saw a red admiral around the far side. There's another peacock. There's three, four. Ooh, wrong place. And there's the fourth. There's a red admiral there. I don't, I don't know where he's got to. So that's four peacocks. Lovely, lovely uh, butterflies. These we normally we wouldn't we wouldn't get peacocks. They're quite rare. Well, for my garden anyway. Uh, and now we're getting no tortoise shells. And very, very few red admirals. I just, I don't know, don't understand it. That's a red admiral at the end there. <laughs> wasp. Cheeky wasp. Uh, I think that might be a red admiral. Might be wrong, can't just quite get it. Could be another peacock. Where? Uh, I think it's a red admiral. So we've got, at present we've got four Peacocks and one red admiral and no tortoise shells, which used to be the predominant butterfly about the place. It's just disappointing, and I do not understand why the butterflies come to this. Butlia, rather than other butlias that I have tried, you know, tried to encourage them to come to, and I have seen butlias in other people's gardens and along the roadside. No butterflies whatsoever, but they come to this kind of purple, and especially whenever the sun's shining on it. And in the past, we have had. The odd painted lady usually had about one every year, but uh, one or two, but nothing uh, seen of them either. No tortoise shells, no painted ladies. And one year, about five years ago, we had, I counted 17 uh, coloured butterflies on this Budley. Now we're getting a few whites, which I don't, can't, haven't tried to identify. They're different whites, um, but uh, they look all the same to me. But they are different. So, uh, no, we are getting a few whites. But you're wondering what effect GM crops is having on these butterflies. You're wondering what effect 
uh, pesticides is having. Admittedly, we're we're only um, in early August, so the butterflies that I saw were were with us towards the end of August. So we'll see what the next two or three weeks brings. Let's hope that there's a few more.